Today, I'm gonna spin this wheel of Gorilla Tag YouTubers, and for whichever one it lands on, I'm gonna use their settings. Meaning their hertz, arm length, and even FOV. Also, quick side note before we start the video, I'm not gonna turn down my world scale so that I look like this. Bruh. I'm just gonna turn it down enough so that it looks like their normal arm length. Alright, time to spin the wheel. Alright. And we got J-Man Curly right off the bat. Alright, so I'm currently using J-Man's Hertz, which is 90. And I think this is about how long his arms are. So let's get into it. This is round one with J-Man Curly settings. This actually feels pretty good, not gonna lie. Like, I feel really, really smooth. Definitely is a bit harder to go on walls. It's not that bad. Arm length is pretty decent too. You can pretty much stick out your arm and you have long arms, kinda. So I guess I'll just have to see how long I can survive with this. There is someone following me right now. I don't know if you guys saw it. Oh, I just juked him, bro. No, 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 no. <laughs> oh man. I think I'm gonna do one more round with this, then I'll switch to a different YouTuber's settings. Alright, nothing's happened. I've only heard like three people get tagged in the last few minutes. Like there's one lava monkey over there at Slippery. Or not Slippery, double. Honestly, these settings feel great. 90 hertz is a bit much, but it's okay. At least it's not 120. Thank goodness none of the YouTubers on the wheel use 120 hertz. I think a lava's on me right now, so I gotta run. Wait, what happened to him? I have no idea where that person just went. Oh, jeez! I hope that guy didn't see me right there. You know what, I'ma risk it and I'm gonna go see how many people are left. Four. All right, I don't think anybody saw me. Yo, that felt so good scaling that tree. I'm actually terrible at the game. And I just dropped my controller, so that's, that's fun. Battery cover came off. Oh man, I got tagged. Well, let's go to the next round. And we got TTT Pig. Alright, I am now on PPP Tig settings, so let's do this. Alright, round two with TTT Pig settings. And I can already tell I feel a little bit faster, and you can see my arms are about his length. Feels really good on walls too, but I might be biased since I usually use 72 hertz. But yeah, overall, I think these are pretty good settings. These settings are actually fire though. No wonder he's so good at the game. Look at these arms. All right, there's a lava monkey on me and I don't know why he looks like that and it's kind of weird. Oh, these is, these jukes are insane, bro. <laughs> Yo, oh, finally. Yo, GG. Nice. So I'm now using Mosa settings, and it's actually not that far off from TTT Pigs. I turned up the FOV, I don't know if you guys can see a difference, but I think you can. And I think this is about his arm length right here. For a better angle, it's like this. Anyway, let's go into some Publix. Round 3 using Mosa settings. I definitely like the better kind of stickiness. Guess that's why a lot of Walls players use 60 hertz. Again, like I said, I usually use 72, so I like only used 60 hertz once before. The only thing I don't like about 60 hertz is the fact that it feels a lot more choppier and it stutters a bit more, but definitely gives people an advantage. Anyways, I should probably focus because I think there's a bit more lava monkey. Yeah, there's two down there. Didn't look that good, but there was two. How, I, bro, how does this man not see me right now? Literally, I am right here, sir. Sir. Oh, man, I can't believe I just got tagged like that. I think I'm going to go one more round until I spin the wheel. Because that did not last long at all. You know what? I'm going to do something I rarely ever try. Oh, shoot. That was a lava monkey. I got to run. Yo, I feel insane right now. Oh no, oh no, I got stuck. No, get away. Oh man. Oh, I got tagged. Well, time to spin the wheel.
I think they actually, I think his arms might actually be a bit longer than this. All right, I think that's about right. As you can see, he has extremely long arms. Like, bro is insane. Let's join some Publix. What is this, fourth round, fifth round? I don't know. Anyway, it's for PKY. Not gonna lie, I feel like I have a slight speed boost. Like, his arms are so long, dude. I feel like bro uses sticks or something now. <laughs> so, you know, I'm not accusing him. It just feels insane. And there's two lava monkeys right there. How did neither of them come for me? Literally, look at this. I just extend my arm on the wall and boom. These long arms are actually crazy, bro. Oh no! Oh man, lava monkey just got me. I wanna do another round of this. Oh, that was so smooth. All right, I'm gonna do something I was gonna do earlier, but didn't get to. Wow. I can't usually go on slippery walls, but it's a lot easier now. You know what, I'm gonna try something. If I just go up to the top of this wall, and I try going on slippery, oh, that's actually insane, bro. Oh, the same dude tagged me. Well, let's go spin the wheel. So I just realized that there's only one person left, that being the hillbilly himself. I believe these are his settings, and uh, I think this looks pretty accurate. So let's go do some Publix. Is that canine curly? All right, this is round five, six, seven. I, I still don't remember which round we're on. And I'm using VMT settings. Not gonna lie, this feels fairly similar to J-Man Curly's. Doesn't feel too bad on walls, doesn't feel too bad on the trees either. Not gonna lie, I think VMT has the shortest arms out of any YouTuber in this video. VMT, don't come for me because I said that. You have longer arms than me, trust me. I just realized there's people behind me. Uh-oh. Oh no, no, no! Oh, I'll get juke. <laughs> oh, I got tagged. Anyways, guys, that's it for this video. If you enjoyed, make sure you like and subscribe. And this monkey is out. <laughs>